where to start learning programming. A quick little answer for the rest of us. Learn JavaScript. It is by far the most flexible and popular language. And start using a larger, more visual program that relies on JavaScript for scripting. This way, you can create your programs visually and then write little JavaScript bits to customize what you need with the help of AI and tutorials. Node-RED is a visual programming environment that is both built with JavaScript and uses it for tweaks and little scripts. JavaScript is not Java. The name mix-up is just some broken business idea from ages ago. And you should also know that people used to ridicule JavaScript because it was slow. But today it runs on the server, on desktops, on phones, and it powers the web. All the websites use it in the browser, and many websites will use it on the server too. It just makes sense to write server stuff in the same language that the browser stuff is written in. The browser stuff is the user interface that you pull up when you go to a .com. The server stuff is where your user interface needs to save something where everyone else can see it. That stuff is stored in a database on the server. And the databases are things that allow multiple users to save data without overwriting each other. If they just used files, then everyone would write to the same file. JavaScript belongs to the C family of programming languages, sharing syntax with C, C++, PHP, Go, Dart, Rust, and Zig, along with the more corporate C Sharp, Java, and Swift. You won't feel at home with those other languages, as each has unique ways of doing things, but they will not feel alien. To quote the World Encyclopedia, C family languages are likely to share some syntax and basic language constructs with C, such as semicolon terminated statements, curly brace delimited code blocks, parentheses delimited parameters, and infix notated arithmetical and logical expressions. The use of the curly brackets to denote blocks of code has led to the name curly bracket languages being used sometimes. I recommend you make your way towards the server environment once you feel comfortable with JavaScript. The server environment is handled via a program called Node.js. It's just JavaScript pulled out of the browser and made to run on the command line. There you can make enormous applications, build things like browser plugins, and run small side project experiments where you for example use a payment gateway to charge a monthly membership fee to something. But before you get there, slow down and master node red. It is not a babysitting application, not at all. Visual programming is absolutely the future. By mastering Node-RED and having your first taste of JavaScript there, you will also discover your first powerful business idea and a promise of a monthly subscription business that could potentially last and set you free from poverty. To put it shortly, learn a Node-RED and then program a Node-RED clone aimed at some specific problem that people have and you can help them solve via visual programming and your library of nodes.
Lastly, if you ever get stuck, first check for videos on the internet. Then see if you can find a tutorial about it. And finally, ask the AI. Please, begin your quest today without any delay by using the magical word tutorial. Search for node red tutorial and then some days or weeks down the road, once you get into it, search for JavaScript tutorial. It will absolutely get easier and sooner than later, because in the world of programming, each new thing you learn enhances all the other things you have learned before.